Hello everyone, and welcome back to Mad Games Tycoon, where I don't really remember what we're doing. Oh, we're optimizing an engine. And then we're going to do a whole bunch of um, contract work, right? Right, guys? We're going to do all the contract work. We don't actually have a game out right now, but I think we're just waiting for a new like topic to become big. If I recall... That's what we were working on. Or we were going to make... I think we were actually going to make another engine. For, like, to optimize things. We're doing pretty well right now. We've got a fair amount of money. We actually have more money than we currently owe. Which is great. Um, so I'm going to pay a little bit of it down. Not that much. Should we get a booth? Do we even have a game? No. So why would we do that? I wish we could, because we can afford it. I wish we had a game so that we could go. That'd be nice, but we don't. So yeah, I'm gonna do all this contract work. And then we're gonna we're gonna make a new engine. I'm also wondering if we should hire some more staff. And I kind of want to. Um they're going to be, like, in research. So I'm going to hire you. We're going to put you in research. You. Um. Sure. I'm going to put you in research, too. And actually, let's grab one more person. I know I'm going crazy here. But let's put, let's hire three people. And then I'm going to pause the game. We're going to put them through the training. Because then we have three more. And we, oh, I, I don't know. There's one other. Can I see who's done training? Like, I know he hasn't. But he's also, like, one of the better ones. Because he's, like, my higher level. Um... So can I just view my staff? Game design. Yeah. He's like amazing at life. Um, so. I could, you know, go put him in. Because I know he has not done the training. But I also feel like somebody else hasn't. Kind of a thing. So training course. Um... Let's put them in the game programming course. More contract work. They can write a story without the guy that's, you know, crazy good at programming. They'll improve their own skills. And then these guys are going to go be in research. I know it's kind of a waste, but eventually we're going to try and move them into uh, development once we have a larger development area. Because I, I honestly feel like moving's going to have to be soon. Alright, let's get you in another training course. Oh, we can do, like, the successful one. Ooh. Ooh, let's, let's put you in the really good office one. Um, we still have one... Oh, gosh, no, no, no. Um... Let's do that last one. I know it's not the most money in the world, but they're taking a course in office work. Um, oh, hey, we got a new one. Sweet. Do it. Yeah, you guys are learning all the things. I'm hoping I'm doing okay here. Oh, we got a new one. Um... Strategy and fantasy, though? I'm not sure those two go together. I mean, I guess they kind of do. You have enough money to buy licenses. Oh, okay, 1.5 million. Um, sell mostly better, acquire licenses now available. Sweet, I was concerned about that in the last episode, if you recall. Um, I would like to develop a new engine. It's going to be optimized. So we have one for RPG, puzzle, um, arcade, and fighting, I believe. So we're going to make one optimized for plat 
platform. No, we're gonna do one for economic simulation. Why not? We don't have strategy. We don't have the one that's like big right now. So, um, platform placer. Sounds good to me. All right. Can do cutscene and the full color support, 16-bit music and sound. I you know, I just want it to have like all of this stuff, but only the best is really necessary there. So yeah, that's gonna cost a lot of money. Um, profit sharing, 22%. You pay me 2,000 to license it. There we go. Took up a ton of my money. Oh hey, you guys are done. Yay! Oh God, no, that's not what I wanted. Training course. Um, pixels for everyone. So they're making new copy protection available. So can I buy copy protection? What do I have? I have no idea, but I should probably buy this one. Oh, we've got contract work too. Oh, we've lost, they licensed RPG Maker. Sweet! Um, yeah, sometimes I really do think that just, um, engines are where it's at. Like, oh, I just want to look at them. We don't have a game out, so it can't possibly be us. Yeah. We haven't made a game in years. We say that like it's a good thing. Alright, so I'm going to have these guys do this last one, I think, for now. I wish you could see who had done which training courses. Maybe they just, like, increase your skills no matter what. I don't know. Possible. Alright. Do this one, too. Make me all the money. Oh, this guy is sick. I don't know what to do about that. Like, is there something I can do to make him be better? Alright, I've also seen where, like, we can go and look at, like, the all-time charts. So we can see where we have placed, which is, you know, mainly, mainly amongst the low ones. But I was watching, uh, someone else play this game and I saw that. Okay. So can't, ooh, we got one. Might as well do it. Alright. I'm actually going to pause the game. We're going to move um, people out. So, there we go. Now you guys are going to research some features because we have gotten behind on that. And we need to update all of our engines because we're an engine making company. Let's be honest. We'll get that done for sure. They're slow, the three of them. I'm researching, but hey. What can you do? Ooh, can we get that done? That's a lot of... Yeah, we can. Um, it's a lot of points needed to get it done. But it's a big payout, too. Payouts are good. So fantasy is what's big. Fantasy and strategy? Yeah. Fantasy and strategy. I don't think we even have fantasy available. Wow, this stuff's just like coming in. This won't take long for us to do it all. In fact, I'm actually going to go back and repay some more of my money. I'd, I'd like to get out of debt. Like, imagine being out of debt at this point in the game. It'd be really, really nice. Ooh, we could actually do this. Um, This would be... Oh, we can't do an adventure game. Huh. That's bad. Well. We could. Oh gosh, there are more. I keep doing this just because it, it really is the easiest way of, of making money. <laughs> and I guess we're like. Reputation. Well, high reputation can offer more jobs. Increases sales. Oh, okay. Um, oh, thanks! Druids and werewolves, too. Alright, they're almost done 
Ooh, we have enough money to produce our own games. Um, that sounds... Oh, gosh. What's this? You need a free production room. Oh, other people will ask us to produce things? That sounds scary. <laughs> um, ooh, high-res color support. Yeah. Research that. Ooh, we barely even have that much money. I don't have a game to go with again, so we're not gonna go. But... We're out of debt! I just killed our debt, guys. Felt like we could do it, like we could afford to. We haven't made a game, but we've been making money, so that's good. Yeah, paying everybody, we're still doing fine. Oh. Contract work? Should we make a game? <laughs> I mean, I feel like the answer to that is, yes, Peggy, you should make a game. That's what this game is about. These guys are very slow at researching features. I'm assuming the features are just more complex now. Um, so. There's that. Alright. Um... develop a game. We're going to do an economic simulation. Um, so economic boost. I don't know. Don't make me make hard decisions. I'm not good at it. I'm going to make it for adults. So we've got economic simulation. So probably cities would be a good one. Um, so we're going to do it with we I named it like I was going to make a platformer one, and then I did it for economic simulation. I forgot that that's what I did. But yeah, we're going to go with that. Um, we're going to do it for the PC and the Apple Mac. So let's use the best one we have. We've never done an economic simulation before, so we can't see how people will expect it to be. I think gameplay is more important. I think game length is more important. Functions are more important. Uh, these can be quite like... I don't know. I might be mess messing this whole thing up. So, what if we decrease our graphics and increase our gameplay? Oh, I didn't want to do that much. Like that? I wonder. I mean, we have a lot of money. Should we just go, like, all in? Oh, we have too many. Um, that's not good. I think joystick driver and sprites we can take out. So, yeah. This is going to cost us a butt ton of money. I'm going to have a make it, though. We're going to do it. We should probably move into a bigger building, let's be honest. Economic boost. A song for a current game resembles a rock song from the charts too much. To avoid being sued, the song has been removed. Ouch. Well, that's a butt thing. Ooh, CD quality music. That's really good music. We should get that as soon as they're done here. Alright. Yeah, so these just take a lot of research points. That's all. So researching it takes a while. Just like making a game takes a while. But that's fine. We should have a game. Hopefully not the worst game of the year. I should save the game in case the game crashes. Because I've been having some issues with this game on my computer. I just don't... I don't know if the game doesn't like my computer or what, but... Um, platforms being taken... We should have checked to see if there were more platforms we could have potentially bought dev kits for. Um... Why is this... This guy is sick, I think. I don't know. I don't know what to do with him. Oh god, I've confused him. Go, you were in here, so go back in here. 
Lots of um, platforms being taken off the market recently, though. We couldn't possibly have won any of them. We haven't had a game out in, like, three years. <laughs> we're laying low, but we're helping... Oh, what was this? We have a publishing offer. Can I take this? Oh, I can't do I can't make it. I don't have those kinds of facilities, I don't think. I have a feeling that our sound is old, too old fashioned, like the sixteen bit. Our sounds are really like we need the C D quality music to come in and be like a big thing. Mushrooms are big. Cricket is not and what? Platformers are big. Um, no, we're not going to do that. We're actually going to move, um, who are we going to move? I Me. Mean, where's that really good guy? Is he him? Yep, into here. We're going to remove bugs from economic boost. You guys do it the fastest, so go. Alright, research features. Texture base. I want all of these. Do them all and do them fast. This is also like we need a larger department for this because 200 bugs takes a really long time to get rid of, and these guys can't do anything. So we're just kind of losing money here. It's okay. They'll figure it out. And we'll start updating our engines so that more people will buy them. And, um, give us money for them. So that we don't die. 40. We're down to 40 bugs. I need a speed that's faster than this one. Which I know could be a very dangerous thing, but I need it. Alright, bugs are nearly gone. Bugs are gone. Release the game. Yes. Ooh, we could self-produce now, but no. Um, this is an economic simulation. So we have Hasbro's. Simulation's really big. Oh, we also have Chemco, who offers five dollars. Hasbro's offers six, so I think we're gonna go here. Come on. Um, Sean, our fans can buy it safely. I'll take it. We put way too much money into it, though. I don't know if we'll uh, break even here. So let's do some contract work. We got a lot of contracts that we can get working on. Keep us afloat. Because upgrading all of our engines is going to cost a lot of money. Which is why I'd prefer to have more features so I could just do like one round. Of just like increasing all of them. Oh gosh. Are we even going to make it? It's going to be close. We barely made it on that contract. There's a lot of points. Oh, I don't even know if we can do that. That's a lot. I think we can do this one, though. Because the other one was the same, but we got six weeks. So I'm really curious to see, like, if we finish this with more than four weeks remaining, we may be okay. And we might be able to take the other one, because it was a lot of money. And, hey, you know. Oh, hey, we already made money with the, uh... Economic simulation. Yeah, let's go for a small booth. We'll take economic boost. We'll get some new fans, maybe? Yeah, we got 6,000 new fans. We more than doubled our fan base. Right there. Awesome. We're the best. Alright, so we did manage to finish it. Oh, the other one was taken away. Okay, that's fine. Um, making the muns. So I think we may have maybe turned things around. I'd actually like you to do an update for this game. Um, yeah, so we they want to see better sound in our games in the future. So let's just do a you know thirty five thousand dollar update. I'm hoping we can pull it out in time before they take it off the market. Okay, we did great. That took no time at all. I know we could probably be doing a lot more interesting stuff than all this contract work, but 
it's a safe bet, and I am I am not good at being safe in this game so far. My track record does not support me. But hey, we've made a lot of money off of that game, so let us. I want them to. I want them to just. Um, do we have any of these we could do? No. 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 Nope. So no, we do not. <sighs> um, 16 weeks, yeah. 16 weeks we can do that much work. How much would it cost for us to move into a new building? Or should we just, if we're doing this well right now, should we save up and jump several sizes of building? I think that might be a better thing to do, like, because just going to here, I mean, yeah, it's, it's nice. Um, but what if we could go to, say, the medium office building? I know it comes with more monthly charges, so I don't want to go too crazy too fast. The Nintendo MES was taken off the market. It's a big day for video gamers when the Nintendo is taken off the market. I think Economic Boost might be up there on the all-time charts right now. Like, let's see, where is it? I don't know, it's pretty, it's pretty far down. It's number 40. You know, we've, we could have done better, but hey, it's, it's a great improvement on what we were doing. Um... So I would like, oh, squids are big right now. So I would like you to research squids. And then um, what is the big real-time strategy is what's big. So um, we don't have a real-time strategy one. But I would like Punchmaker to be updated. So we'd like to give it, oh, wow, okay. It's missing out on a lot of features. I didn't notice that it was that lacking. Fighting games don't seem to be super big. So I'd also like to get real-time strategy as soon as this is done. Because that doesn't take long. Genre, so real-time strategy, please. I don't know if we're really going to get a... Squid real-time strategy game out there. Oh god, I didn't want to move the desk. Um, develop, improve, platform placer. Can I name? Yeah, let's rename this to um, Money Booster. We should do a platform one. I, I fully believe that we should, but we should, you know, name it appropriately. We should name all of our engines appropriately. Alright, Mad Game Awards. I don't think we should win Worst of the Year. We did? We made so much money with that game. Why was it the Worst of the Year? I don't understand. Alright. It's going to take them a while still. So let's update... Another engine. So we've done Punch Maker and Money Booster. So let's do RPG Maker now. The better music, the branching eye, and the shader support for wonderful, wonderful looking pictures. Alright. Hey, we made $1.2 million. Almost $1.3 million. Don't tell me that that game was the worst game of the year. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, now we just have Puzzle Maker that needs to be updated. Oh wait, no. We did Puzzle Maker. Oh, this is Punch Maker. Sorry. I thought I clicked Puzzle Maker. Puzzle Generator. Sorry. So we're going to increase this profit sharing a little bit because we're about to give it way better things that it can have. Probably best to put the older ones in there too, just because, you know, some places they might be running a little bit behind on what they can make. I really want this real-time strategy squid game though. <laughs> and we're gonna put a lot of money into it, because we lost all our fans with our game that made us a bunch of money. Um, contract work. Yeah, let's do some contract work. Oh god, 
I noticed how like little time we got for this one. That might not work out so well. I am not happy with that at all. I don't know if we're gonna make it. Please tell me we can make it. It's gonna be close. We did it, yes. Okay, you guys are almost done, come on. Thank you. All right, I wanna develop a game. Um, squ Quiddy. Squids, I don't know. It's gonna be a B plus size game. Uh, it's gonna be a real-time strategy, so select a topic, squids, select a subtopic. We don't have, like, ocean or anything, so no. Real-time strategy. Um, so we don't have a real-time strategy engine, so let's see if we can find one. There is not one um, for real-time strategy. There are some for strategy. Um, so I'm honestly going to make it with this one. Because I know it's not the best thing. So we could buy a license. Let's see. Um... How the Grinch Save Christmas. That's cute. The sixth element. That's also cute. Why not? Let's let's try it out. They're supposed to do better. Um. So I would like this one. Sure. The sixth element. It's a squid game. Squid horror by the sounds of it. Um, platforms. So, can we buy a platform? Let's see, dev kits. Nintendo SMES. It's a lot of money, but it's fairly good market share. So, let's do it. Why not? Can I even do four yet? I can. I totally can. Should I? These are the real questions. We also have the game joy. Sure, we're gonna we're gonna make stuff for Nintendo. Cause I said so. Okay, so this is a squid real time strategy game. Um Yeah. Yeah, I'm kind of, you know, taking shots in the dark here. This definitely seemed to help, putting it in all the languages. Yes, it made it cost a lot more. Um, oh, well, then we still want that, yes. Um, we're still two over. Um... There we go. Go. And then you guys are going to keep researching features because I want to make engines. It seems to be where the real money is. I mean, our last game did really well. I'll give it that. Like, it did very well. It got us worst game of the year, but it made us $1.2 million. I don't know, maybe it was like a cult like favorite and that's how we made the money i don't know like can i look at like why my games did so badly what's this oh i think that means i made it for somebody else yep it does um Okay, we have a lot of contract work sitting around right now. We got nine whole, uh, whole contracts, but we're we're busy, you know. Trying to increase the sound. Should I move two people in here and have them start combating bugs immediately? This is gonna slow this down so much, but remove bugs from the sixth element. You know, if we can kind of work as we go, it'll go a little bit better. Yes, this is gonna slow us down so much. 
Ooh, um, can we go with a game that's currently in development? It looks like we can. I mean, yeah, that's definitely a thing that people do at conventions, is they bring games they're still working on. I definitely think that's a thing. For sure. So. Make me a game. Wahahaha. So, I mean, yeah, everything's going slow, but... I mean, we probably could afford to hire more people. We got a lot of people, like, available, but... None of them are, you know, amazing people at what they do, so... I don't know if it's worth it, or if we should just keep moving people around for right now. Because, I mean, he'll slowly but surely research all of LAN multiplayer. He's almost there, as a matter of fact. This is kind of keeping bugs at, like, minimum. Six element. A virus caused some of your graphic files to be deleted. We're trying to compensate for the loss. Wow. No. And uh, no. Don't do that. That's bad. Oh, you're done. Um, keep researching. Ooh, pre-rendered graphics. All them graphics. Ooh, we're doing recorded dialogue. So I'm hoping that we'll see music like come up to like the points values near the others. That is what I'm hoping. Got all my fingers crossed for that. It's, I mean, it's close to technology. We're doing CD quality music right now. That should make it go up. And see, the bugs are already low, lower, because we had people in here working on it immediately. Should we hire two more people? I don't know. Uh, no, don't publish it now. Finish with the bugs. I'm gonna let them do it. It's like, we don't have a game out, it can't be us. Eleven bugs, ten bugs, come on. We can do this. I have faith in us. Okay, it's done. Actually, curious. Can we do any of this yet? Nope. We can't. I don't know when we will be able to. So let's release the game. Um... Oh gosh, yeah, look, this took off. This is now our worst. Like, our technology is considered probably bad. Let's find a publisher. It's a real-time strategy. Um, these guys like real-time strategy, and they have a lot of market strength. So, yeah, let's do it. Our numbers aren't looking too terrible. A little polish could blow a long way. The sound is the best I've ever heard. New, rec new standard in sound. Controls are below average. A little polish, they'd be good. Although the gameplay has weaknesses, one can live with it. The game isn't too bad, but could definitely use some improvement. I will take it. Alright, you guys get back in there. And then I'm going to have them start doing some contract work. And I'm going to move you in here, and you are going to create a game report on the sixth element. It's going to sell, hopefully, a little bit better just because of the, the wonderful um, license that I bought for it. We should probably also do some updates for it. We really want to push sales. Um, kind of a thing. That would be good. I mean, we've already we've already made money and it's got three hype from the license so that's pretty good all right I would like you to do an update um, yeah let's enable all just do everything you can do in an update because yeah it's sales are dropping off and I don't want that at all. I want it to keep making me money. I want it to be like one of the best games of the year. Updates. Enable. 
come on. Yes, that boosted sales back on up. I wonder, like, how much, like, will this eventually stop helping? Because it's, it's price is going up each time I do it. Come on, you guys are almost done. There we go. So let's keep researching features. We're going to put them into all of our uh, wonderful engines eventually. Oh, you guys are done. Oh my goodness, I need to stop trying to move that. Um, like, it, it keeps going up in price. Like, I'm looking to see if we have another boost here. Not really, so I think this is going to be the last update we do, and then we're going to switch back over to contract work. Yeah, they can do it. 16 weeks, they can definitely do that much work in 16 weeks. Alright, I'm just interested in getting this game report. Oh hey, look, they launched a marketing campaign. Hopefully it'll keep us going. Alright, let's see. We were all wrong. I really needed to know how to, like, do this better. Yeah, squids did not go well with it, but my market of adults, or no, of teenagers was good. Okay, good to know. Oh god, I think I've picked up two people somehow. Oh no, you could do that. I guess you can, though. Um, can we still go with- yeah, let's go with the six element. Again. Yeah, more fans. I think it's really important to have fans. It gets you hype for your games. This might actually increase sales. It did a tiny bit increase sales a little bit. Why are my fans sad? Um, your fans are unhappy. You need more staff for your support team. I don't even have a support team. Well, that's not good. Anyway, guys, I'm going to end this episode of Mad Games Tycoon here. If you enjoyed it, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And as always, I'm the Purple Peggy Sis, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.